Welcome back, Prime Nation. About seven days to die, Alpha 21. If you missed the last episode, I'll link in the top right hand corner. Last episode was Horde Night, day seven. We used this base and it was absolutely fantastic. It worked really bloody well. I think we'll be okay for day 20, uh, day 14. Day 21, not so sure. But we trapped him down there, we threw a load of pipe bombs down, we shot him and smacked him in the face. It was delightful. But today, Prime Nation, we've got a tier three right here. We're gonna go into the tier three, and I think what we're gonna do next after that is maybe there, but I wanna head over here and open up this trade route. New trade route, hopefully a new trader, hopefully better weapons and all that kind of good stuff. I've repaired up the bat, we're good to rock and roll. So yeah, without further ado, Prime Nation, let's come and do our first ever tier three mission. Alas, we have made it primation. It's quite dark and gloomy. I've noticed that it's always, always raining out in these areas. Uh, food and water isn't the best. We'll probably switch down some food or eat down some food and keep the rest. And I think we're good to go. We'll probably plunk it here to save some inventory space. And we're good. I haven't done this. Oh, it's a level three up there. Three skulls. Bloody good. Pay us some gas. There should be some good... Uh, it's a good bit of... Oh, there's a guy right there. Look, these guys are tanky. So that's forever new primation. We're just going to head in and have some fun. Now, I haven't done this um, POI since 2022. I don't know why I said that. I meant Alpha 21. <laughs> Alpha 20 even. Bloody hell, get right, primation. So it should be an interesting time doing what we're doing today. Can I get you from here? Yes. Oh, and we've woken up five people. Great. Yes, and I think there's one more knocking around somewhere over here. But this bat is doing some real damage. Real damage. One to the noggin. No harm done. Fantastic. This guy's, these guys were beating on this uh, barrel right here. And I thought we might blow up and I was a little bit nervous. But luckily, we've done pretty bloody well. So I'm going to get all of this because we do want to start working towards sometime soon a mini bike. If we can, fantastic. If not, we can save up some petrol or some fuel for maybe some molotovs but either way fuel is definitely definitely a good thing to be getting can you ah oh, the rain's finished oh scared the crap out of me what was that <laughs> there's something outside iron tools level four oh it was you iron tools level four don't mind if i do that is fantastic probably won't uh i say waste probably won't waste all iron getting the level fours because We've got level 3s, and to be fair, we'll probably get level 5 pretty soon as well, so it's probably not worth in, worth wasting the iron to get those. Uh, anyone going to jump on my head? Hopefully not, so we'll do a bit of looting whilst we're here. Yeah, we'll save up to get the level 5s. Um, we can't make steel tools yet. We haven't actually got the pieces for it anyway, so it's not really a big deal. We're going to have it been here, so I'm kind of just running around, seeing what this uh, POI has to offer. So far, not too much. Okay, right, so it must be through here. Yeah, it's definitely through here. But I say, not much, whole lot of nothingness. Uh, do you know what? We're just going to read that. It's, we probably get a, a bit of money for it, but I feel like we're doing okay money-wise at the hot moment. I feel like our tools and our weapons are not doing too bad. Now, this is a clear area, so it should be nice and easy to go around. I've got to worry about picking anything up and missing supplies, so it should be a case of just cracking some skulls. Ah, it's main loot room. We found the main loot room, but we'll come back for you soon, baby. We'll come back for you soon. Okay, I'm guessing some sort of jump scare. There we go, breakout. I knew that was going to happen. I just saw that a million miles away. One coming from there. Is it, uh, you're going to jump down? Oh, I see a guy. Job, whilst we can. Let's just get that sneak damage running whilst we can. Uh, whilst you're chilling, can we get one? Oh, to the shoulder is better than one than nothing. Ah, oh, yes, he didn't die, but it saves me having to... Oh, did I see a runner? I... Oh, I think I saw a runner. How are you getting to me, then? How are you... How are you getting to me? I'm pretty sure I just... Yeah, there's definitely someone sprinting around down there. Try not to use too much of these arrows. I only got 30 out of them. Ah, oh, he pooped out a loot bag. You're going to come here, aren't you? I bet you are. Are you going to come from here? I don't know, but I've got to find a way to kill him before they get here. Oh my Jesus! I was reloading. I was not expecting that. I was not. Right, okay. Double barrel for the win. Are you ready? Jump. Oh, there's another one down here as well. I just saw him. Right, he's dead. Good stuff. I just saw. Right there, another mutant. I was trying to shoot some guy in the head over here. I don't think he died though. I want to get that loot bag. Right, can I 
Can I do some sneaky sneakies whilst we're here? Oh, hello. You here to see you about my extended warranty? Nice. Nice. I'm trying to coax up that. Where is he? The mutant. I want to try and get the mutant up here if I can. If we can get the mutant up here. That'll just... Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Ah, oh, he's jumped back down again. Yep, he's definitely dead. And I think you're the only guy left. So can we... Oh, that was a terrible shot. Right, okay. We've attracted a few zomboids from the outside just because of feral sense, I think. Because, yeah, they're not on the map. So I think this is just feral sense zombies. So I think we might just go down and kill them. Holy Jesus Christ. Right, okay. Well, it seems... We have other zombies that are getting blown up for some reason over there as well. Do you know what? I'm going to use these arrows because uh, there's a lot happening here and maybe I will not. I just saw though. I was going to go down and kill them. But I've just seen something. Yeah, go down there. Look. Oil shell. I don't mind grabbing some of that because that's the first load we've seen. If I can grab a little bit of that now, it may save us trying to get some later. <laughs> he flipped. He flipped. Got one more. One more. You should be dead. Oh, oh, oh. How did you get up here? You saucy little devil. Is there a way in? Oh, you must have climbed somewhere else. I'm, I'm not even too sure how you got here. Do you know what? Let's stop messing around. I'll come back for the oil shell in just a moment. And peace and quiet at last. Uh, that bag's gone. Okay, cool. Right, okay. We're fine. We've finally got a point of peace and quiet. Thank goodness. So they crashed in here and that's how they climbed up to get me, which is all well and good. I'm going to quickly, yeah, we'll quickly grab this. And I think that's it. There's no more anywhere else. So, yeah, that's good bloody stuff. What do we get? We get this. 400 oil shell. Not too bad. Are we all reloaded? You are. You are not. I think I might actually go ahead and maybe make some iron arrows. Because that is actually coming in a little bit handy when I don't use my shotgun shells or my actual ammunition. So, maybe a little thing. Oh, wait. Loot bag primation. Loot bag. Ha ha. Loot bag, what have you got for us? A uh, bit of money, a little bit of food, with bullets, nothing too special. All right, it's taking me a hot minute to find out ooh, to find out where to go. I'm guessing there's something up here. Oh, don't make me bloody tightrope something, because I'm probably going to die. All this for literally nothing. Is there anything here? If I just come here for no reason? I feel like I, I may have. Aha! I found a hatch. I'm just going to yeet it. Yeet! Yes, okay, that is where we're supposed to go. Bloody hell. It took me forever to find it. <laughs> okay, that was so not worth it. Right, so how do I go or where do I go? Oh, that's where we go. <laughs> that scared the crap out of me. I noticed this door was open. That scared the bejesus out of me. My lord. Right, one down. Almost two down. Almost two down. Two down. Come on. Three down. Oh, this bro, I'm so glad we made it. Four down. Five down. So good. No, wait. Five not down. No, wait. I bought mission. None down. <laughs> and we done it. Clear area. Oh my goodness. Right, we got a point there as well, Promation. Gee, that was a great mission. That was so much fun. Right, Papa Pete's level 10. We're on level 7. We was putting points into this. I think it's level 10. Yeah. So it was on heavy armor. We was rocking some more heavy armor. I feel like boomstick's a good idea though. Yeah, we get a couple in boomstick, couple in heavy armor, and I think that'll set us straight for the next kind of in-game bits and pieces. Uh, I feel like that's done. Right, loot room up the top. We have earned this primation. This has been fully, fully, fully earned. Give me the bag. Uh, fist will sell. Have you got a buster on there yet? We have. But I think you can put down other things. Okay, maybe that's a sellage thing. Anything in here? Uh, not particularly. Anything in here? Medicine. We'll take that. Right. Let me open these three boxes and this chest. Swedish. Right. Let's open all of them. We have. We have tools. Level five. We we'll probably go ahead and make the level fives to be fair. A bit more, a bit more fuel. Steel tools level one. Oh, okay. Uh, let me check this because I, I don't I've never actually looked at this before. 
Steel tools level one. I think steel tools require steel tool parts. So I know we took a little bit of uh, steel from the trader. Axe, yeah, so we need, oh, just one part. So if we need a pick, we need a workbench, and we need steel tool, that's probably doable. That Wow, I'm quite surprised. A beaker, you guys were saying to buy one, we have found one. This we can sell, that might come in handy. This we could probably use. Lots of little bits, we got a few bits for animation. I am super chuffed, super happy, very, very happy. We've got all this, we can just jump down. Jump. Oh, no, we can't jump off in excitement and get the hell out of Dodge Primation. Let's go and see what the trader has to offer us for a quest reward. So apart from a little jump scare, I think that mission went particularly yeah, well with this bat and all these wow. points that we have. You it, uh, so we've got that, oh, it's a, a higher level. I, I don't think we'll go for that because I feel like the magazine bundle is probably more important. Still arrows, not that fast. Iron Breaker wouldn't be too bad, but I, I still think we're at a point where magazine chasing is a key thing. Let's take the magazine chase. Anything close, infested zombies right around the corner, hell yes. Let's sell all the bits. And that will do. Now, uh, crafting skill books, tools, hell yes. Armor crafting, hell yes. Uh, or a lever, that's not bad actually. Um, and improve, improve clubs. Level three, so we can craft the level three. That's pretty cool, we're making some serious progress. I am so happy. Very, very good. So a couple things I want to do. I was thinking whilst I was killing. I've done a few fast-paced motion kills there. You guys were saying you really do like when I like do the speed run things with all the, like, the funny like noises. I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll put some more in there. Not a problem. Let's collect some of this. So things I was thinking, Primation. Let me show you. I'm thinking to myself right now. I want to get this finished. I don't like living up here. I want a base base. Also, I want to improve the horde base. We could focus on it in a couple of days. So I want to... Upgrade this, but for that we need clay. And I could just do some digging, get some clay stuff to upgrade that base. Kind of a two-way a two-way whammy. At the same time, I want to do some missions whilst the day's young and we've got lots of time before the horde. And I also want to unlock the new trader. There's so much to do. Let's check our money sitch. What how much money have we got? Okay, just topped up on the eggs and bacon. We've got 14 grand. Oh, we've got loads. 14 grand. I think I uh, do you know, I think it is trader run time. Look, we've got all these bits and pieces to sell. This, 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 this. Yeah, I, I think it's trader run time because all this I'm not going to use. That for turrets, that can go. Yeah, we, we've got a hot amount of money right there, Primation. We really, really do. So saying that, I think it's time that I take a big old trek over there. That's going to take me a hot minute, Primation. But you never know. We could have a trader Hugh, a trader Bob, a trader Rex, a trader anyone who gives me anything other than food that she and the other lady gives me. So yeah, three and a half K Primation. Let's get moving. Quick pit stop primation. I'm thinking we're passing gens. We may as well check on her, see how she's doing, and see if she's got any fix. I don't think we've checked her since the restock. Oh, at level four, we can probably make that. Another B car. Uh, no hard hitters. You do have this, though. Oh, I know we've got that already. Uh, anything worth buying? Duct tape is, is a maybe, possibly. Eggs and bacon, potatoes. Uh, knife will go and miss, but it's not worth the money. You got a couple of bits. A silencer. Oh, that would be great. I, I actually feel like that would be a very good purchase. Because I never see them. Whenever I play, I never see them. I am going to buy you. I'm actually going to sell these bad boys right now. Bang. Back up to almost 15k. Real. Do you know what? Silencers are great. I, I, I tend to use them quite a lot when I find them, but I never get them in any playthrough. I don't know if you remember any of my playthroughs, any of my streams. Very rare I find a silencer. So if I could fire one this early on day eight, we could do some really, really good sneaky stuff at night once we've got that. So yeah, anyways, where are we? We are 1.8k away. After we quickly eat this, we are going to continue to the new trade zone. Hopefully he's in a, hopefully a desert. It looks like we have a wreck. I've passed a couple of lumberjacks already and they're looking pretty beefy. And I know they are super tanky and super hard. So yeah, I did go into the desert and it showed as one, um, let me just quickly show you. See in the top right, uh, oh, where are you? you? You just came up, where did you go? Right, basically the snow biome, let me try and show you actually, it's quite important. The snow biome, you're gonna show me anything here? No, so basically up in the top up here, it showed one and a half orange heads for the snow biome and it showed one orange head for the desert biome. Which just says to me that the desert is less, uh, sorry, not as powerful as the snow. <laughs> so it would be nice to go into the desert and do a couple bits, but it looks like we're heading direct into snow, which is a little bit troublesome. So I'm not sure if we're ready for it, if I'm being completely honest with you. 
I'm just going to grab all this. You know what? Let's, uh, let's whiz through this super quick. Those guys outside are going a little bit nuts. Now, I don't recall if there's anything actually even in here that we can loot. Oh, no. There's a couple of little bits. So nothing too special. Can't loot that. Can loot this. I will chat to you in just a moment. Now, this guy is the seed guy. So he doesn't actually have much in the way of loot. I was hoping for some sort of gun, weapon, smith person. I think it's Bob that does that. But, you know, we get what we're given. Let's see. You can't search these. Can you search these? No. Okay, right. Give me the XP zoids. Have you got any jobs? Right, tier ones. <laughs> do you know what? You might just do mercenary. Oh, sorry. Mercy point camp. I thought you said mercenary. Right, sell some bits that we just found. Will you give me more resist, though? Get the fuck out of here. Oh, do we... Uh, I don't think we should sacrifice. Yeah, we should really sacrifice that. Um... All this could just go. We don't need any of this clutter. Oh, this we will read. Huh? Well, and this we will read. And we got... What do we get? Oh, what do we get? We got... No, I lost it. We found something. Let's see what you have to offer. Eggs I will take for sure. Uh, any other food? You sell some good food. Some very good food, actually. 28 potatoes. Not bad. Tools. No, we're good for tools. Oh, shotgun weekly. <sighs> Oh, may have to get the shotgun weekly. Uh, nothing too special in there. You got a pistol, nothing too special. No, you haven't. You have. Oh, lucky looters. Might be worth it. Uh, will be worth it. We'll buy that bad boy. And I think that's pretty much it. And we'll buy the shotguns because we can. Other than that, my friend, I think you. Uh, yeah, I think hey, you're pretty much sale. finished. Right, read. Like Pipe that. shotgun level four. <laughs> Obviously, I want to try to get as high as possible. Ah, uh, bugger. Yeah, try and get as high as possible. There's really not much to get. So, should we go ahead? Where are you? Are you in... You're in a snow biome. Right, let's see if we can kill these guys. Oh, you are pretty much extremely tanky compared to standard Zomboids. Uh, you wasn't. Let's let this guy in and see if we can fight fight him. Oh, there's two of them. I just want I just want I just want to test. Like, because if four or five of these come from behind whilst I'm in a POI, I don't really want to be trying to take on POI guys from the front. These super duper tanky guys from the back, because I just simply will not survive. All right, I'm gonna see if my my heavy attack holds up to these boys. 50 stamina. Oh uh oh. Uh, yeah, we're getting some good XP Zoids, but they're just, they're so tanky. So tanky. Should we try a level one? What's the time? Damn it. I, I always waste so much time. It's five o'clock already. <laughs> Why am I like this? Uh, we'll get this. We'll get this. Should we try a level one? Should we try a tier? Oh, I'm not going to see the bears when they come. This is a very, very, very big mistake. God damn it. Okay, let's try a tier one in the snow biome. Okay, what I'm going to do is leave bikey poos outside. We're attracting zombies already. <laughs> leave bikey poos outside. Fill it up with just some goodness. Uh, we'll keep that. Some of this we could probably just throw, but yeah. Uh, get rid. Scrappage. Uh, keep you. Just for now. Right, I've got to remember to put that on. Can I put you on anything? Uh, I can't. I really want to use this now. I've got it. Right, let's, uh, let's smack this guy in the face. Swedish. Right, do we need to eat and drink? My only worry, honestly, is bears. I feel like we'll be okay taking these guys out. Eat you. Drink you with that efficient digestion malarkey. Right, the game. The game. The aim of the game. Uh, yeah, I was going to say is to just... Oh, uh, about to say fire everyone and then loot so I can switch into the other goggles. It's only a tier one, so I can't imagine it's too crazy. I can't imagine two crazy tier ones. I'm hoping the outside of the POI. Uh, come on, can you break it, please? Thanks. I'm hoping the outside of the POI oh, keeps everyone else at bay until such time that I can kill everything inside. And come back, loot it all, and hopefully be good. Come on. Come on. Thank you, Trader Jen. I think you are. I think that's it. Uh, unlock. Yes, sweet. Oh, I think it's just one guy. Just one little guy. Right, this is a clear area. All right, no, there's still more. Again, we are going to come back and loot everything with the lootage goggles. After we kill everyone. Oh, Bernie guy. I thought so. Usually squishy. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Almost cleared. Tier 1s are fun. They're easy. They're small. They're quaint. They're very beautiful. 
Oh, 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 what the hell was... Oh, my God. <laughs> Why do they do this to get the crap out of me? <laughs> I hate you, game. I hate you. Come on. Oh, that was a bit of a delayed reaction, wasn't it? It sounded like shotguns went off then. That's what freaked me out. Right, we are done. We killed every man and his dog. Oh, there's a big tanky boy outside. Right, now, let's switch this. I don't know where main loot is, so let's just... Let's just search everything super quick. Uh, hit you. I should open you. Fantastic. Right, lootage. I think we're done. I haven't found any main loot, but I think we're done. So I don't know where main loot is, to be honest. We came from in here, so I assume... I suppose it might be up... Are you still trying to break through? You are. Oh, that opened the top up. I'm so stupid. So silly. Right, that should be good to go up here for main. Can we lock you? We cannot. Right, let's hope these guys don't come up whilst I'm doing things. A pistol! Hey, I won't say no to a pistol. Journal. Nice. We just unlocked frost bites or fort bites a moment ago. Hopefully they don't break up whilst I'm smashing this. Give me a beaker. Come on. I knew you wouldn't. Right, switch to the XP Zoids. We got a few things. We got a few things. So we got gun, which is pretty bloody good because we can just waste those um ammunitions from that. Or even scrap it down to get uh, the parts we need for what's the word we're for turrets or that kind of good stuff. Uh, nothing really worth doing here. Bike is out front, I believe. Oh, he's managed to break his way through. Right, whilst you've broken through. We're going to jump out the front and we're going to get ourselves a zombie head. Nice. And it quickly puts a few bits in the bike. Quick, 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 quick. Uh, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do. And let's get back. How does it? Because, hey, a tier one mission, a few hundred jukes for the sake of it. Let's see what quest rules he gives. I'm actually pretty, uh, pretty interested to see what he gives us. Congratulations. So he's going to give us all, all 10 glue. <laughs> right. So here's my thought pattern. We can make tons of these. Uh, probably that's quite a good one, but not important right now. We can make these, so not important. I feel like that's going to be a big thing. So, our next weapon we need is some sort of good machine gun, and that is something I'd happily purchase. 10 glue early game is probably a big thing as well because we need it for everything. I'm going to go with the ammo because it's the hardest thing to get. We probably can get glue now. We've got three catches. Yeah, let's go with the ammo. I feel like the ammo is a good shout. Any ammo is, is, is definitely a good thing. Uh, any close stuff. Buried supplies. I don't fancy digging in this area. If we can do a clear life hope cabin. Can we squeeze in for the end of the day, do you reckon? But first things first, Primation. Sedage. Not much to sell there. Right, we got another point. Yes, we did. Again, I feel like boomsticks. I feel like boomsticks. And I, I feel like... I feel like we might start saving points now to go up in our main strength skill tree. How close is this bad boy? Ah, oh, it's miles away. Ah, bugger Rooney, what's the time? Ah, oh, it's dead at 9 o'clock, privation. I feel like I'm going to have to end this one here. I was going to try and squeeze in another mission. I didn't realize how far away 3.5k was. It was quite a mission. It did take up the majority of the day. So I'm going to spend the rest of the evening hours heading back to base, which is an awful long way away. Awfully long. What I'll be doing in the night time, Primation. I'm going to head back now. I'm going to dig some clay around at the new horde base because I want to A, prepare it for day 14. B, I need the clay to make the cobblestone. Um, and C, I need to actually switch up the bars in there. You guys were saying for scaffold ladders, I think it was. Because you can shoot through them, melee through them, and throw pipe bombs through them. So, a few things we need to do. But yes, I'm going to head back Primation. There are loads of cars along the way back. And there's also a, uh, a whole town full of letterboxes or mailboxes. So, I think in the next episode, I think we're going to go around for a bit of a sneaky free-for-all loot in the town which is right here i've barely touched this i thought we should go around and just get every single uh, mailbox grab all the cars and just go the goodness that it has to offer i do want to try and find some sort of town in the desert 
Um, although we are burning up in there, I feel like it'll be our next reasonable place to loot. There wasn't much of a town back there, so eh. decisions, decisions. But Prime Nation, hope you enjoyed. Smash the like if you did. First time here, do consider subscribing. As always, keep crafting it for survival, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Okay, Primation, it's half two in the morning. I'm making a crap load of cobblestone. I'm starting to get a little bit of uh, iron now as well to try and get these up to tier five, tier five, tier three, and tier five. So I'll be here for a little bit, Primation. And as always, I'll catch you all in the next one.